well on board the Catriona um, as I've decided to survive for the autumn and the winter um, despite the information that I was given is completely wrong uh, I'm going to live forever how could they get that wrong eh? terrible science they have around here um, so I'm preparing the boat for uh, the you know colder weather and uh, autumn and, and winter so to keep myself uh, entertained and, uh, and amused I popped up to Bodmin to uh, tend to my ornamental garden up there by the uh, the old jail in Bodmin their house used to be the prison chaplain's uh, house there it's an amazing garden so the dogs are there uh, rhubarb and piglet uh, boxer and uh, small thing about this big it doesn't matter what it is so it's, it's about that big it's a thing right <laughs> apparently it's a type of dog <laughs> anyway so um yes yeah, so i popped it up to uh see my friends up there and uh have a break from preparing everything for the uh the boat catriona for the winter as you'll see later on uh I've got some winter flowers in, in bath numbers uh, so my summer flower display is not the end oh no 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 oh no 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 <laughs> uh, and maybe next time uh, when I speak I'll tell you a different type of story that you've not had from me before we'll see I'm considering so keeping the garden going going well for me i hope this won't be the last time i'll see my my garden here because uh, of course i have my other gardens too you must remember my, my uh, wild gardens too um, but the chances to see the gardens are becoming less and less as my sort of physical ability becoming less and less just to climb one one layer layer of steps is completely exhausting for me so i can see the end it's like approaches but slowly and there's still plenty of time i still think i'll be on the run I'm still on the go until christmas where i can cause some trouble over christmas time to everybody i certainly have plans for it <laughs> yes so here's uh here's a tara who madly seems to uh uh, live here sometimes she does and sometimes she does a strange person the tower thanks swap basically uh yeah i'm atara hi this is rhubarb she very much enjoys playing with the ball um and as fatty says this is uh, mum and dad's garden um and bat has transformed it over the last i don't know year two years ish maybe and and the 30 years before that <laughs> and the 30 years before that um as there was a gap it all got a bit unruly um so he went a bit mental when he came back and chopped everything down um so it's now looking like a pretty decent pretty decent garden isn't it ready come on oh no she lost it she'll find it she always finds it. Where's it? Well, you're useless. So I work in uh, mental health at university, which is pretty full on and stressful most of the time. Um, and one of the things I love to do to chill out and help me deal with that is hang out in the garden. Um, whether it's just sitting here playing with this idiot or actually gardening. Um, I particularly like uh, fruit and veg. So I love grown tomatoes, um, not so good at grown cucumbers, tried my hand at some other things, strawberries are generally pretty crap, uh, so tomatoes are pretty much all I can do, but it doesn't really matter, I enjoy it and it helps me um, sort of deal with the day to day life, so I'd recommend it to get outside, a bit of nature, fresh air, a bit of green space, for me it's what it's all about. 